Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is still Monday, November 5th, 2018. I am the Drunk Poker. Tis beer time. We continue our journey with LCBO available gift packs, mix packs, whatever you want to call them, with our first entry from Ontario. From Like a Bice comes the Toasty Toes Taster Pack. Hmm? All right, you get five beers and a pair of festive socks. So it comes with Sparkhouse Red Ale, which is probably the, their most classic beer. Like, that's the one that kind of you, you associate with them from the beginning. Uh, the Ox Tongue India Pale Ale, which we're going to drink today. Switchback Pilsner. Night Watcher Oatmeal Stout. And the Broken Axe American Pale Ale. So really something for everyone in there. I know Mrs. Polk's probably going to steal that Night Watcher because we had that the other day. Just a quick one. I, I haven't even looked at the socks yet. But I am down for a pair of festive socks. And yeah. Um, those are pretty cool, and they feel like relatively thick, so I think I'm going to steal those for myself, you know, because I do need a new pair of socks. But let's talk about beer for a minute. Now, uh, this one retails about $19.95, I believe, so five beers, pair of socks, 20 bucks. Sounds good. Let's uh, let's get into it, though. So the rebrand last year on Lake of Base was well-received. It was nice to see. I mean, they've come a long way. They certainly launched enough new beers that it was exciting for beer nerds, you know, to, to be able to go back and say, oh, shoot, they've got new beer, so let's try it. So Ox Tongue is a 6.2% IPA, a little more classic style, West Coast style. We haven't talked about it in quite some time, which is unfortunate because it's a nice beer. But as you can see, that kind of coppery pour, thick white head. Notes of orange, caramel, grapefruit. Again, this has got Pilsners in there for your, you know, sort of non-crafty people. The oatmeal stout for your dark beer lover. And then it's got a couple of pale ales in there, plus the red ale, which is very, very good. I, underrated red ale. But uh, cheers to, to Lake of Base for entering the, the, the pantheon of LCBO available gift packs. But, uh, let's get into this. Cheers. Easily one of my favorite Lake of Bays beers. Lake of Bays! Lake of Bays. Every time we would drink a Lake of Bays beer back in the day when we first started drinking craft beer, we would be like, Lake of Bays! Um, very nice toasted bready malt backbone in this one. That's a West Coast style IPA with lots of citrus, grapefruit, orange, pithiness, bitter piney resin on the back end. It is a very approachable and accessible, nice West Coast representation of what an IPA is. One of my favorite styles, not to dissuade anybody from the Nipas, but to me, this is this is my favorite kind of IPA. I like the kind of maltier profile. So anyways, there is something for everybody in this. It's a cool pack. The gifts, come on. I mean, that this is it. If you've got craft beer lovers, they can be difficult to buy for. Like a base makes solid beers. Having the socks in there, it's just kind of fun, you know, and then again, why not, you know, you got five different styles of beer. You do have an IPA and a pale ale, which will appeal to the hop heads. The red ale will appeal to kind of the maltier fiends. The switchback pilsner, like I said, is for that maybe the non-crafty person. Give them that approach or that, uh, let them see that, you know, craft beer can be something less than just big hoppy bastards. And the Night Watcher Oatmeal Stout, which is more of a session stout, low ABV. Good to try, my friends. Look forward to your local LCBO. Wear your socks to the Christmas party and show off your love of great Ontario craft beer. Cheers, my friends. Enjoy your day. I'm going to drink most of this pack real soon. 